Hi Sasini, I have just woken up from a nap and nilikuwa nimelala kwa usingizika for and that it is a get ready with me that is a t-shirt and a mommy jeans and then on the other hand I have uh, this two piece. I feel like I don't know what to wear but nataka kuziva zote mbili. Usha I get ready you know I feel like you have two outfits. Nikiva mommy jeans I'll do it with this shoe and don't ask me why ni make a tissue you all know nikifua na ikanga tissue that is a secret <laughs> and then I have these doll shoes if I wear the two piece I'll do it with uh, these uh, doll shoes so it is a get ready with me it's around uh, 3:30 and I'm so hungry I'm so hungry yani I am so hungry Um I have spent the whole day in the house I was reading the bible and taking notes I even slept on the carpet yani nimeamka tu sai and the first thing first we get ready unaenda kususu you know when you wake up you must go and susu and and still nita oga alafu kuna nguo nilikuwa nifue hiki tu nilimhakikiwa nayo na nini mixed berries del monte na imekataa kabisa kutoka nimeisook na jik imekataa kabisa i don't know what to do guys please please nitafanya nini cuz nimeisook for sijui how many days and then i'm so hungry na tunaenda out kukula but i feel like i shouldn't wait for the outing cuz i'm so hungry i'm dying <laughs> i'm kuniambia kujikalisha na kujangana all this i am so hungry na nimeshinda kwa nyumba and i don't feel like cooking Neither do I have anything to cook. I don't have shopping. So, nikaamua kumtumaji mbele nyuma niko na 15 bob. Mbele nyuma niko na 15 bob. Sasa so, so what can 15 bob buy? So tukazimazima gas. I want to step out and see what 14 15 bob can get me. So let's go. Come with me. Come with me guys with our 15 bob. Hey. Hey, I need a sugar daddy or something. And then I got chapo. Kuna jamaa mwingine yupika chapo hapa. Chapo tamu sana. Ana nikarudi. The sun is very hot. Nikasahau ki si kufunga nyumba. So nikapata gate imefungwa. Nijaribu ku unlock na kidole. I unlock akili nimekaa hapa. Sasa makosa ni nimeacha gas on. Makosa ni yangu. Nachungulia hapa nione kama nitaona mtu sioni. Aki nika knock, nika knock. Nilikuwa na simu nikapigia kiateka akili mtu wangu. <laughs> So nikafika kwa nyumba there is my chapel na nikakula and then I got uh ni tukachukuana na gengeng yangu when I say that you all know you all know tunaendaga out na kina nani so <laughs> tumeamua tunataka kwenda SNL kukula nyama choma pale SNL so we've never been there so we just want to go and try the nyam choma the only base ya nyama choma na jua mzuri na kali sana i would highly recommend is in thika and since i'm far from thika not that far but it will take time sasa na huko ndio tunafika githurai githurai 44 snl is located huko so tumekuja kukula nyama choma it is around 6 yeah 6 yeah, 6 yes 6 tukula nyama choma and then twende nyumbani with my gang gang tuko na njoki uh, dada sara and i why am i yawning mhm So come with me come with me twende tukule nyama uh huh uh huh it's a beautiful day it's a beautiful day mhm mm so tumechukua uba itulete hadi hapa SNL tukule nyama mwenye ina unanga na shida ngao kwa SNL ni bote i guess hii ndio base ya bote and this is the famous SNL and then all of a sudden tukatolewa kwa club na nduru yani watu wakaanza ku scream just opposite the road just opposite the road we had people screaming and tukatoka nje haraka sana and the reason is why they were screaming it is because the biz some businesses were burning ini base ya kuuza nini mtush like kuna jama ati anakwanga hapa na sweat pants okay we don't know the cause of the fire kwani ni opposite snl eh mimi sisi tumetoka huko kama ni lad grabbers on a mission mimi ni mimi nakuona david moshi tumza mwingine what happened ati kameanza kama kama kumefanya siku na chomeka this motor is a very Like, on the other side of the road, 
but una feel ni wapi una feel yeah. to a point like una feel like <laughs> hello guys una za zima dia joko it is very hot so business about to me to make some people are trying to rest to something cuz kuma to make like that whole part inaendelea tu some people wanasema ati ati someone ni yeye amekuja akachoma atameka diesel sijui nini but pia easy businesses kuna stima so i guess that is the reason as to why hii moto ni kubwa alafu tena hii utu tu nyumba tumejengwa na na torofa au so moto ku spread it is very easy watu wazima moto wanaitangwa na wanakujanga the last minute we've been here for the last like one hour by the way tunajangalia tu moto ikizima watu wakijaribu ku rescue vitu alafu nasikia huko gedhura ya kunanga maji so there is no way these people will start nini kuzima hii moto hata watazima na nini na kuna maji jameni eh hey, Nairobi mko na shida Nairobi kuna shida mingi sana angalia hii moto and it has been burning like that for for like an hour so afterwards it will burn all that place you place your tenani business za watu oh my god alafu wazima moto sasa ndio anajifikisha after the businesses have burnt to ashes imagine wana kuja kuzima ashes and so sorry to kwa wale watu walichomekiwa na businesses they got rest to back here Mungu anaonekana hata because I know it is not easy. It is not easy. Atumefunga biz, umeenda kwa nyumba. Alafu the following day, ama kwa kwa nyumba unapigiwa biz na yako inachomeka. And that is your only hope. It is not good. It is not easy. Ime cost moto. Ndio. 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 Ndio.